Now, ice is a language that not many people can speak, but all can understand it. It speaks the language of the soul, which is exactly what young artists Akai Lascott and Natalie Moore did to the judging panel of the 30th Barclays La Atelier Art Competition, which announced its 2015 winners in Johannesburg on Wednesday evening. With his installation titled Small and Common Matters, the Pretoria-born and Bayes Lascott claimed the 2015 uh, uh, title, while photographer Natalie Moore from Johannesburg claimed the Gerard Sokoto Merit Award with her collection titled Once Upon a Time Josie. The two award-winning artists now join us in studio to chat a little bit more about these awards. Good morning, welcome to Morning Live and congratulations to both of you. Thank you so Thank you. much. Kai, I just want to start with you. You won the major title on the evening. Mm -hmm. What does it mean? Well, <laughs> um, we artists enter this competition every year when we have a work that we think is worth entering. I've been entering since 2003. I never made the top 10 until now and actually ended up winning the top award, which is a really big surprise. <laughs> My goodness, and I'm going to ask you to tell us a little bit more about what you think you did differently with your installation. Mm -hmm. But Natalie, for you to get the Merit Award that you did and for your collection, what does it mean for you? Oh, it means so much to me. Um, complete surprise. I think I represent the other um, side of the spectrum. This is my first time entering an art competition full stop, never mind such my a prestigious word. competition. So to get, I mean, just to make the top 10 and then to get, uh, you know, to have the honor of, of getting this award is... I always find it interesting when we speak about art and competitions because they're kind of not really two things that would one would naturally gravitate towards one another. But what actually inspires you then to decide, you know what, I've never entered a competition um, because I just do my art because that's my expression. And you decided now, I'm going to enter a competition. I think, I think it's the exposure. Okay. The exposure that uh, this competition kind of um, gives to you. Mm. Yeah. And, and, and for you, Kai, you, like you said, you've... You've had a long journey with this. What was different mm -hmm. about this year's piece that you think really caught the judges' attention? I think I had a lot of time to think about it. Um, <laughs> maybe all those years. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah, I was awarded uh, the Zult Foundation residency last year, which is a residency uh, which is also attached to the atelier. So one of the Atelier winners uh, also goes to Zult, but I won it as an independent award. And I got to spend two months on an island in Germany. And the island was disappearing into the sea, which I found quite interesting. It's a very narrow island. And this made me think a lot about the world. And it was a particular inspiration for a comparison within the film that I made in which I compare the way that the Earth is seen from space to a grain of sand under our, our toe um, as a metaphor for the world at large and our inability to, to relate to things that are so much bigger than us and things that are so much smaller than us but are inextricably linked in the ecological crisis that we face. Where can people actually go in and see small and common matters? Well, they'll have to go to the APSA Gallery, okay. uh, which is in town, in the city. Um, they can they also see all the works from the other finalists. Okay. And, uh, yeah, hopefully there'll be more shows as well showing this, this work. Uh, Natalie, that's where people will also be able to go and check out uh, your photos and your collections of Once Upon a Time in Jersey? Yes, uh, the whole Top 100 will be featured, I think it's until August, if I'm correct. And it's open to the public. Um, just remember to take your ID, though, or they won't let you in. Ah, uh, OK. <laughs> Probably rag rugby tackle you at the door, so just remember. <laughs> <laughs> Gladly, so it's been great to chat to you guys. I wish we had a little bit more time, because it's, it sounds very interesting. I think I must uh, make a trip down to the APSA Gallery in Johannesburg mm. so that we can go and take a look at all the wonderful artwork, something that needs to be brought into the public space a lot more often. Thank you guys very much, and congratulations on your awards. Thank you. Thank Thanks you. for having us. Kyla Scott was named the 30th Barclays Latley.
Atletia art competition winner on Wednesday night, while Natalie Moore walked away with the Gerard Sokoto Merit Award. The competition named its winners on Wednesday evening. It's time for Morning Live to take.